Hi, this is Kevin Schofield, and we're back in the Tech Lab today to talk about our latest plugin. Today we've got a plugin for the Microscribe series of digitizers. Now the Microscribe is an interesting little device. It's actually a portable six-axis articulated arm. It's very good for reverse engineering by collecting points by scribing across a part. But we've actually got a plugin to use with our metrology applications, Qualify and Qualify Probe. Now when you couple the low price of the Qualify Probe with the Microscribe, you've got a very good low-cost metrology solution. And I'll give you a quick demonstration of how it integrates into our products. So here we'll take the arm. And you'll see it's a six-axis arm with removable tips. You've got a, here we've got a six-millimeter ruby tip. You've also got an actual sharp point that can be used if you don't want to have to compensate. And what we'll do is we'll take points you can see as we um, move the device. We can collect points. As we collect them, just like all the other articulated arm devices, we collect the input at the center of the probe. And there you start to see a graphic indicating whether we're in or out of tolerance. And we collect our six points to do a quick six point three two one alignment. Okay, and we put the arm down. I'm actually acquiring points with the little clicker here. And once we're aligned, this allows us to do all the same things that you can do with our traditional metrology devices. Things like probe compare. So probe compare is a really quick, easy way to collect real-time measurements. So if I want to know the deviation at a certain point, place the probe tip on the part, click the button, it collects a point, reports back to me what the deviation is, as, and creates a little annotation. Now all these annotations and these points are populating a table at the bottom, and when I'm done, I'd be able to output a report in a variety of formats, just like with our regular products. So again, just in a matter of a uh, few minutes, with a small device that doesn't require any clamping, it can sit right on the desktop, I'm able to get some fairly accurate readings on the deviation of this part compared to its nominal state. And again, once I'm done with this, I can click OK. I can do some feature creation of cylinders, planes, cones, perhaps even do some GD&T measurements with the probe tip, and then ultimately create a report that I can output in a variety of formats. And that is our integration of the Microscribe into GMagic products.